Hello. Morning. Morning. This is, uh, God, I've forgotten already. Flintlock Siege of Dawn. That's the one. That's the one. I think. Okay. Yes, correct. Flintlock, the Siege of Dawn. Press A to continue, which I've done. Warning! Photosensitive epilepsy. A small percentage of individuals may experience epileptic seizures when exposed to certain flashing lights or patterns. Blah, 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 blah. Immediate stop playing. Consult the doctor. The usual stuff. Okay. Okay, they've got a point off me for allowing me to read that and choose when to move on at my leisure. Please. No, no, they didn't even see, say please. I, I put that in automatic. It's called being polite. Adjust the slider until the light and dark images are barely visible. Okay, so let's... Oh, ah, hang on. The light and dark images. All oh, right, okay. Now they're fucking there. That was a weird one. So we're we coming down to... What, should we put it on 60 or put it on 70? We'll put it on 70 for now. Uh, is that it? Okay, let's go into settings first. Controls, invert Y axis. Why is this not default for people? People who have it as normal. The oh, freaks. Ah, you have to hold it down. Okay. Uh, oh, actually, thinking of it. Uh, ah! What changes? Have I just... No, that's saved. Okay, so. How do I get back? Ah! Right, gameplay. We're looking for subtitles. Graphics. Audio. Everything's on full. All the subtitles seem to be on. All right, okay, we, we're not going to piss about with opacity of the text. Let's just crack in or crack on. Story mode. Oh, now it asks me to do it. Okay. No, for ten bitter years since the dead broke through the door, I've promised you peace. Today... I'm making good on it. Sama hatched a plan to blow up the door, to cut the dead off forever. Alan and I volunteered. We probably won't make it back, but I would rather take my chances than leave you in this broken world. You deserve more than a letter you'll never receive. But we both know you would never let me go. I lived a long life, but never a full one. Not until I found you. Promise me you'll live, Noor. I'm off to earn my rest. Baz. Okay, then. So it's it's a zombie game. Is that right? Zombies with weapons. not accepting anyone. Just pretend I loved you, all right? You sent Baz and Harlan to the door to the Great Below. I don't have time for this, Vanek. Requesting permission to... Denied. 
Bass can't fight at his age. Harlan can't cover for him and blow the door at the same time. I'm the best upper you've got and you know it. Return to your station, Vamek. Was that? Can't have been them. The blast came from too low, wasn't nearly loud enough. I see. They're late, aren't they? Just give the order. <sighs> All right, then. All right. Follow the trenches to the old fort. Stop for nothing and no one understood? Yes, Field Marshal. Okay. Zapparan, clear the way. No rest till dawn. No, no rest, rest till dawn. dawn. Okie doke. Right. So, I uh, move R to look around. I shall do that. Okay, move L to move forward. I've done that. Any other hoops I have to jump through in order to get on? So, don't stop for anything. So, if that's the case, then whilst I'm doing this, there shouldn't be anything for me to, to pick up. Shouldn't be any supplies or anything like that. Oh, the white paint. Right, so, A is jump. X is... X is something to shake a bottle. Um, y... Doesn't seem to do anything yet. Now B is... What the fuck? Oh, that's got to be some sort of speed running fucking thing going on there, haven't it? Like some sort of weird um, dodge move where you slide on mud. That is odd. Right. Press 8 to mantle that. Press left stick down to sprint. Okay. All of the panic. I thought you died. Sorry to disappoint. So which one was the huddled soldier? One of these? I've been told not to stop, and yet you're distracting me with people talking to me. That's it, salute. Anything here? No. We'll be while moving to slide. Yeah, we've Found that one out. Firearms. Firearms are powerful weapons used to fight the dead. Are they not? Press right trigger to shoot your primary firearm. Shooting a primary firearm consumes a black powder charge. Black powder charges are restored by hitting enemies with melee attacks. Land four melee attacks to restore one black powder charge. So I basically get bullets per hit. Okay, so. Ah, right stick to lock on. Move hard to switch targets. Now right trigger. What was that? What was all the what was all the jumpy shooty thing? Right, okay, so this is more of a melee based. Can't even aim right. Okay, press X to drink from your healing flask. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Thank you very much. What was that? Oh no! I pressed the wrong button, so I've lost a charge now because I accidentally pressed trigger. Press A to jump. That was quite a leap, wasn't it? Oh, here we go! Almost got a powder charge, or sorry, a second powder charge. Right. 
Pistol disrupt. No ass pistol is effective at disrupting enemy attacks. Okay, press right trigger while an enemy is attacking to disrupt the attack. So it's kind of like parrying, I guess. Blah, blah, blah. When an enemy is disrupted, they're knocked out of their current attack. Okay, so I'm assuming then that I've got to do that with this person that they're just... And there we are. Reputation represents your renown and experience and can be spent to obtain skills and items. Okay, excellent. I'm just going to flick through this. Hold the right, no, the left button to claim any reputation earned from combat. Right. That seems like a absolutely pointless maneuver what, what why do i need to do that i'm a bit lost as to that okay white paint here we go all right what am i dropping down onto nothing here we go I missed that parry opportunity there, didn't I? Right. Do, 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 do. Can I, or do I waste my time if I coax this person back here? And then one, two, three, four. Got my thing. Ah, run away. I coax them down. He's a bit of a speedy one, isn't he? Definitely the 28 days later version of one of these. Ah, oh, it's a parry guy. Here we go. Let's try again. Thank you. Right. So, much like other games, do I need to have this continuous combat, or can I just fucking leg it? My usual MO with games is to just run. Okay, so I'm assuming they've either got to kill this guy before the gate opens. Oh, here we go. Block and parry. You can use your melee weapon to block and parry enemy attacks. So you can parry then. Right. Hold left button. Right, blah, blah, blah. Okay, here we go. Let's give it a go. I'm not very good at these, so... Not sure if that was what they wanted me to do, but right, they obviously want me to learn how to parry because this health bar is not going down. All right, so I've got to do this maneuver before I can progress. Okay. So that's not correct then, is it? Okay. Try again. It's not... It's the timing thing, I hate... That's right. Okay. Alright, okay, I'm already hating this. They're going to force me to do stuff in order to... I, I play these games and I'm okay with not parrying. I think the only time I ever parried in Elden Ring when there was that boss in the DLC... Not a boss, an enemy in the DLC that you had to parry in order to... Because you, you couldn't, couldn't have any form of combat with them unless you parried them first and they did a drop. I did it once, I got the drop, I never did it again. Just avoided them. Break attacks. 
blah 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 dangerous armada right so I gotta disrupt it with a pistol is it right ah so it's a boss and I should have had I pressed the wrong bloody one let's try again so when it goes red, fire. Okay, maybe not. Right. Slide, slide, slide. No. What in the pits are you doing here? This this pressing to get the reputation thing, I, I it makes no sense to me. I don't get that. I don't understand why we've got to do that. I'm here to kick your ass for leaving me behind. I can't let you through. You could get killed. You could get killed. Did you even think about that? No, please. This whole mission is just Just pull the damn gate up! Oh. Both of them. Small favors. Right, okay. Um So that eye gouger was some sort of like early simple boss. And yet I don't think that uh, okay, let's just try if I move the camera, there you go. Get a better chance of seeing some of the stuff. Not that it's important. Yahara is. Listen here, you little French filler. Keep it down. The shimmering wall is bad enough. You want to bring the dead on our heads? The shimmering wall? Yeah, the shimmering what? I don't understand. Why have you stopped talking? Okay, let's have a look up here. No, can't go up there. So for some reason. Okay. Maybe that's used at a later date. Ah. They've all decided to join me. Is this where they all die now and I have to... What in the pits is that? Some kind of wall. It's not glass or stone or any other damn thing. We could scale the stones to the parapet. It couldn't extend over that. What have you done? Getting us through. Right, okay. We're having stupid dialogue like that then, are we? Okay. Those gouges on the wall are glowing. Why are they glowing? Souls below. These bodies, they've been here for years. The dead must have gotten them while they were fleeing the city. They look smashed. Toyed with. The dead don't do that. Keep your eyes peeled, will you? Whatever did this is probably still around. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. It does look nice. It does sound nice. Can't fault it on that side. Oh, this looks like a big boss arena where your friends are going to die. Uh, oh, maybe not. Everyone get clear. Pulse below. Right. Okay. Guardian of the door. Yes, that thing is. Snap out of it, 
calling. No rest till no dawn. Rest till no rest till dawn. No rest till dawn. But what if it just wants to be your friend? Come at me. There we go. Where have they gone then? Sorry, have all your friends died already? Okay, what's happening here? Ah! Where were they just now? Slit its throat. No! <sighs> what if they suddenly just come back from somewhere, have they? Access the settings menu to change the difficulty at any time. All right, I've already done that. Harlan, don't. Where in the pits am I? You wouldn't know, would you? Right. Why are you assuming that isn't going to kill you? Follow me. I'm sorry. What? Hey, hey, hey! Wait. Right. Be I dragged you out of the river. You were unconscious for a while. After. Uh, there anyone else with me you were alone no matter you'll have to do do what am i going to do exactly your kind meddled where you shouldn't destroyed the barrier that kept the gods contained what barrier you mean that's the main wall we... So it was you. we couldn't i didn't know the damage is done now you must mend it Right, okay, so before there was any communication, she assumed that because it was small and cuddly, it wasn't going to kill her. This is like the Prometheus level of dumb fuckery. When it comes to dealing with things you do not know. Huge spider web. Okay. Didn't get any spider warnings at the start of the video though. Which I've actually I've actually seen happen. Ridiculous. Oh. If it's able to jump, why isn't it jumping further? Or is it just limiting itself because of Right, okay. Smash that up then. Oh, no, there's no white paint. I can't go up there because there's no white paint. So there's not going to be any crafting in this game then, or not many pickups, which is uh, okay. Go to the edge, jump off, plop. The god you unleashed is called Uru. It is his army of the dead that has been laying waste to dawn. The source of all your suffering. And how is it that you know all of this? Because I am a god too. 
You tiny talking fox thing. You're a god. There are lesser and greater gods. My name is Enki. You probably haven't heard yeah. of me. So why should you trust them? Consider me your chance at redemption. Your kind ravaged my city. My world. Killed everyone I've ever loved. Every breath I take from here on will be spent exacting my revenge on the gods. What's to stop me starting with you? Nothing. Death to gods. You assumed because it was small and furry. Alone, you stand no chance against a god. Let me help you. If you're a god, you're one of them. Why would I do anything to help someone I've sworn to kill? If it's vengeance you want, I'll give it to you. As long as Uru is free, your world is in mortal peril. Help me seal him away. Stem the tide of destruction. It's the least you can do. Well... It, it, it's not... You have a deal. Any hint of trickery and I'll be burying this axe into your skull. I would expect well, nothing less. Now how do we get out of here? This way. Right. Okay, first of all, she's making a threat about putting the axe in his skull, even though she was just bested by him not actually doing very much. <sighs> okay. What kind of stupid fucking storytelling dialogue bollocks. I couldn't beat you just now, but should you have, should you cross me, I will. Shut up. I never asked your name. No, my name's Noon. And the axe? That's not a woodcutter's tool. I'm a sapper. I fight in trenches, tunnels. Lots of uses for an axe down there. You're a capable warrior then. I'm efficient. Okay. Can't smash everything. Only a few pots, and none of them seem to give up anything when you smash them. <laughs> Where do I go? There's no white paint. Okay, I just wanted to double check that. Got this weird falling animation. Just floating in the air. At the risk of death, of course you. No one hurt. I just wanted to see how far you would get. Ah. Come here. Hand me some of your black powder. What for? You'll see. Why? Good. Now try keeping up. Keep up how? Hold to open skills. That's the wrong button. Skills. All right, what do I do? Powder mobility. You can perform special powder moves that enhance your dodging and aerial mobility. A powder move? What the hell is a powder move? We got powder and steel. What's this then? You can enter a blocking stance that prevents damage from melee attacks. By blocking an attack at the moment of impact, you parry the attack and render the enemy vulnerable to your counter attack. You cannot block or parry break attacks. Oh, I've already got it. Oh, right. Okay. It's, I've got to get something I haven't got. Uh, you can perform a quick melee attack out of a dodge or whatever. Insufficient reputation. It costs 2,500. So the only one... Well, I... Right, so it's asking me to... 
Oh, right. It's telling me what I've acquired. That's the reason why it wanted me to come into this menu. Right. Okay. Yeah, I'm not reading all that. And this looks like a bunch of faff. So, there you go. Oh, that's what I just did, is it? What was that? I infused it with an inkling of magic. It should help us get around. So jump. Ah, I can, uh, right. Okay. Yeah. This Uru the Ravager. A title he's rightfully earned. It was in every storybook they read to me when I was back. And now he's loose. Right, so I've lost the ability to go sliding around. If I press it again, I've got to do a stupid dodge now. Falling is dangerous. Thank you. If you fall too far, you take damage. Often fatal. Break a fall by pressing A. Okay, I got it. Got you. Witherings, what's this? Witherings are powerful magical abil magical abilities. Wow. Unique to Enki. That's that guy then, is it? To use a withering, you need to build Enki's withering gauge by defeating enemies, which is now appearing in the corner I've shifted the camera to. So let me go uh go to the right. There you go. So if I press A. Press Y and left button to cast Curse Storm against the enemy. Boom! Shakalaka! The dead shouldn't be here. Where is this place? How far away from the trenches? Things have changed while you were unconscious. You should best see them for yourself. How long, how long were you unconscious for? Why would you trust this thing anyway? Why, why, why isn't it taking you to the boss that pushed you off the bridge accidentally and can't go in the water or whatever reason? What reason have you been given to trust this? Priming enemies. With Enki's help, you can quickly defeat enemies by building their priming gauge, then perform a critical attack. Oh, do I have to do this kind of shit? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, yeah. Ow! Just a lucky blow. Down so easily. I marked them for death. Help speed up the process. Oh, hang on, I gotta get my percentage. I, I don't understand what that's even all about. Another one. Armored enemy. Some enemies with arm wear armor, which significantly reduces the damage they take from attacks. Yes, okay. You can remove enemy armor by priving them first, blah, blah, blah. I, I don't care. Right. Build the armored enemies. 
final gauge. So if I keep pressing Y, then... Checkpoints. Why have I got a checkpoint now? I'm in the middle of a fucking fight. Literally in the middle of a fight. Calm down. I'm nowhere near it. Wait until I get there to tell me about it. Ridiculous. Right. Let's get that percentage thing built up. Uh, interact with the lodestone. Okay. Select skills to open the skills menu. That's what I'll do. Play a menu. Oh, I saw this business. Yeah, okay. Blah, blah, blah. Ooh. Powder magic steel! Hold A over a node. A skill node to purchase the skill. Ah, I do have enough now so I can purchase something. So which one do I want to do first? Let's try this one. Let's just do it. Because... Oh, there you go. Uh, okay. Feeling pretty good. All right, fast travel. Finally, we're out. Is that smoke? This is way past the trenches. The coalition would never. The dead spilled out of the door when Uru was freed. The coalition didn't even stand a chance. I did this. Time to put it right. Yes, you did this. It's all your fault. Now you must feel immense guilt. Hamlets, a small communities, blah, 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 blah. I'm so bored with these games where I have to do a vast amount of reading. I'm just going to skip through them from now on. Incoming. Defeat the leader. Occupied area. So the game doesn't really encourage you to do a lot of exploring because there's like there's nothing to find anywhere, and I can't smash barrels. So it's quite linear. But I did put it onto story mode, so that could be it. I something tells me that's not the case, though. Oh, okay. That wasn't supposed to happen. There you go. Ah, so I have the powered ability now. I can press left button and Y. Weird combination. just see white paint. I kind of did, so what's up here then? I right, said so nothing to collect off any of these bodies. Any particular reason why I should be up here then? None whatsoever! Zero percent. Thirty-one coins or whatever they're called. Is this the boss? It would appear so, wouldn't it? The Iron Crown. Left button and Y.
Army of the Dead defeated Port Solace. 200 points gained. That should be all of them. We should check the coffee shop. Call everyone back. Coffee shop? I'm sorry, what? What just happened? That is a very curious hound you have there, madam. Does it bite? I'm, I'm, I'm fucking sorry. Where did this just take place? Where did I just have that fight? I want to go back there. I want to know what dropped on the floor. If we could fortify this place, we should be able to hold out until the wall dies down. It was over here, wasn't it? Wasn't it by here? So for some unknown reason, I defeat a boss, the entire area. This war has gone on too long. The entire area gets replenished with NPCs and fixed automatically with no account for the time. Is the host back at her hearth already? Never left. Said she's been in that coffee shop 200 years and she ain't running now. Okay, so I've got to go and meet someone now, have I? Oh dear me. Coffee shops. At the heart of every hamlet is a coffee shop, of course. Uh, after defeating the enemy leader, the coffee shop will open and lock in a new checkpoint. Oh my god. Really? Inside the coffee shop, talk to the host to restore your health, gain a reward and purchase new clothing. I, yeah, I don't care. Furthermore, the host may provide you with the latest rumours in the area and lock in new side quests. Of course they will. Right. They don't have a face, but they have two arms holding up a mask. All right, then. Bless you, girl. The dead came over us like a wave. If it hadn't been for you... Best not celebrate just yet. This whole mess is far from over. I'll let the other hosts know. Keep an eye out for you. In the meantime, here. One good deed deserves another. Healing flasks, blah, blah, blah. When consumed, restore 50% of your health. Increases your maximum uses by one. Jolly good. All right, let's have a look in the shop. See what she's got. Right, so this is this is just cosmetic crap then, is it? Is that right? Yellow trousers, brown, brown trousers. Yeah, brown trousers. In case you shit yourself. Wow, oh, this is fucking rubbish. Yeah, let's leave. Don't be a stranger. Oh, no. Those below, it really is you. Over here. Boss! It says, don't be a stranger. However, you're not actually providing me with anything that I actually need. I don't need a different colour pair of trousers. Fucking stupid game. Did he always have one leg? Boss! A leg. Uh, blast the most of it. Infection of the rest. I knew you'd made it. I knew it. Did anyone else make it? Did Harlan? He fought to the end. Got that winged bastard good. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, no. Pity me if I'd lost you. We're wasting time. With the dead loose, we have no chance of reaching Uru. Souls below, it's talking? What is that thing? I saw it fighting with you outside. He's a god. He's gonna help me drag Uru back into the great below. Is that so? Tell me, little god. You wipe the dead away with one stroke. Blow away the walls of dawn with a swish from your tail. I. If we're going up against an army, we'll need a proper fighting force. Three Peaks is the only place that's still got one. That's a month's ride from here, Baz. Two weeks. If you cut through Satrap's Wend and travel light. I know a couple of guides that can take us. Lead the way then. Okay, travel to Three Peaks. That's what we're gonna do. Our worst fears came true. When the Coalition's lines broke, the dead spilled into the world. It took every treacherous back road I knew to dodge their hordes. To push them back, we'd need an army. 
The only place that still had one was Three Peaks. A hard place, breeding harder people. Its knights are the oldest and greatest army in the world. Conquered most of it, even. Now they rest on their laurels. Rich off the fortune in black powder under the kneeling keep. Two grueling weeks later, we were in sight of their capital. The city of Rit. Let's hope they'll help us save the world. Maybe then Nor will forgive herself. Right, okay. Oof. Fast travel. Thank you very much. Fast travel, fast travel, fast travel. Right. Let's wait a bit. We barely had time to set up camp. At least get some food in you first. What? The coalition needs that army, Baz. The sooner we get them the help they need, the better. <sighs> Can you hold on until I check your axe and gun? They're fine, Baz. I need to... Just needs a bit of wood, iron and sulfur. Won't even take a minute. All right, we're supposed to be at war. The undead have broken through, and there's a god on the loose. And for some reason, he's got a fucking guitar. Fuck this game. So, they're possibly yeah. There is crafting materials which I have to gather. Right. Silly me for thinking that I would have not needed to be able to have done this why well why don't why don't i just do it then while you sit down strumming on a fucking guitar if there's stuff to do aren't you part of this fucking war why are you playing a guitar oh dear you've got a bit of a bad leg well, I'm fucking sorry, but I thought there was a war going on. Okay, so... Wouldn't it be around about now where this dog thing is going to actually provide you with something else, maybe? If you're not too busy fucking strumming. The sappers at your campsite can upgrade your weapons and armour. I haven't got any armour. I've got clothes on. Blah, blah, blah. Upgrading, upgrading. Upgrade. Let's upgrade the axe. Upgraded. Nose axe to level two. Let's upgrade the gun. Level two. Oh, and it takes up your reputation if you go any higher. So I need more wood. All ah, right, okay. So there may be some at some point there may be um, needs to do some farming. The trail ahead leads to the city. You can request an audience with the judges there. Meanwhile, I'll talk to some of my people in the keep. Grease the wheels if I have to. You know people in the kneeling keep. The perks of running were scumbags in my youth. Some of them got to very high places. I'll meet you at Pilgrim's Band when I'm done, all right? Don't take too long. Right. Play Sebo. What the fuck is this? We could play some Sebo. Sure, I'm game. Why is this in a game where we're at war? Why is he strumming guitars? Why is, why are you being given the chance to play games? There's a fucking god on the loose. Oh, what? Your goal is to create a triangle rift with three coins before you run out of turns. You have 12 turns. Yeah, I'll forfeit the game. I don't I don't fucking care. Yeah, I want to lose it. No, I do not want to fucking play again. 
What the fuck? Why the fuck is this in the game? Why? Why? I am not going to look for something else to do if we are... Fucking hell. You're just copying other games. You didn't sleep last night. Or the night before that. Well, I couldn't. What with you scampering about? Sleeplessness only makes you a liability. You should. I'm all right. The bridge is gone. Damn. I have a better idea. Touch that skull for me. Mm. All right. Why would that be there? I'm sorry, why would that be there? Why would... Okay. Press Y to rift travel. Okay. What was that? It's called a rift. On to the next one. Rift launch. Rift boost, B. Is this even safe? Mostly, yes. X to drop out the rift. Y to rift travel. A to jump out of a rift. <gasps> Souls below. I can get used to this. You might just have to. Okay. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Halt, Outlander. State your purpose. I need to see the judges. It's urgent coalition business. The coalition has been declared an enemy of the Kneeling Keep. Since when? Why? For heretical possession and use of black powder weapons being an affront to Ramuha, goddess of the peaks. Do not resist. This is ridiculous. You can't do this. Bailiff, restrain her. Yeah, come and do that. Stop her in Ramoha's name. Oh, let's go this way. Um. Why? Keep tapping. Why? Stay alert until then. I'm just trying to learn whatever the hell the point of this is. Ah, so it's like a finishing move then. They mentioned Ramua, another god. She must have also escaped Dawn when the barrier fell. Another one. I let out. Another one, and the knights are on her side already. I have to stop them. Before I can get to Uru, I have to stop her. Perhaps Baz fared better. Right, why have you introduced playing games and side quests into a game where it's the utmost urgency to defeat these gods. What a fucking stupid game. All right, so I've got... Oh, there we are. So let's do this. And there's a thing called rest. So if you rest... Is it like the other games that you can play whereby it resets the enemies? Oh, is he sleeping? Finally, some respite. So let's go back up here. And they're not back. Okay, so. No farming for points then there. And uh, let's go in the opposite direction to where they want this to go to see what's here. Any surprise uh, bosses or 
Well, I, I wouldn't really say looped because there's not much loot in it. What's this then? What was that? Okay. Gavel gate. Leaders defeated. Okay, let's... Uh... Oh, hang on. Oop, look out. Here it is. Right. I, I'm not quite grasping why there needs to be the skull thing that you have to do if the god is in fact helping you across these ravines. Can't you just go up and go press Y? Why do you need to have the skull? Why do you need to have the skull thing going on? What's all that about? Alright, okay, let's... Oh, what's up here? Is that is that a dead body? Can't you just loot it? Um, oh, we have something sparkly here. I'm sure you'll find a use for it. Conscript buttons. Okay, so we have, in fact, got certain amounts of loot or items we can collect. As well as farming for materials. Oh, look out. Shielded enemies prevent all damage from the front while they are in shield stance. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Here we go. Bring it on. That's the wrong button then. Oh, I gotta. That's right, I gotta do this, haven't I? Sorted. Yeah, sorted, Governor. Gain my reputation. I can't get my head around as, as to why I need to do that. Why do I need to press a button to get the reputation? That is bizarre. Now, who's this now? Oh, it's your friend. He's moved up. Okay. There's another god. She's in the peaks already. It's worse than that. Ramu has in the kneeling keep itself. No one's allowed in there anymore except her and the judges. Coming here was a mistake. We need to leave. Try somewhere else. I'm not going anywhere. Not while Ramuha's wreaking havoc at the peaks. What about you, Enki? Are you going to let her drag you into this? Not to my death, certainly. But I share her sentiment. Well, you aren't going to get anything done unless you get into Ritz. And the city is swarming with knights. We need someone to sneak us in. And I know just the one. His name is Young, former forge master of the keep. Last I heard, he'd hold up in mudfish, but every road to it is blocked. Like that's ever stopped us. All I need is a barrel of black powder, and I can breach through. There's a fort down the road. If the knights have been confiscating black powder, they'll definitely have a stash there. Right. Okay, do you know what? I think we're into, yeah, we're coming up to about an hour's worth of uh, play in here. I've got a good idea as to whether or not I'm going to bother with this game. It's okay. Visually, it's quite nice. Uh, I can't say I've experienced a lot of it to the point where I think the sound capabilities are outstanding. It's all right. It's, you know, for what it is. A jumpy, climby, kind of shooty, roundy type of thing. Uh, 
Am I likely to bother with it? Do you know what? Oh. Fuck. All right. Calm down. Right. Okay. What can I do here? Take. Ancestors are souls that escape the great below, venerated by the living for the favours they bestow. Visit an ancestor to gain their favour. This favour temporarily boosts all reputation you gain. A favour is lost lost when you res when you rest. Return to any ancestor to regain it. Feel that power. Right. Okay. So it's just like a perk or something, is it? Like a temporary boost to something. Okay. You say so. Um, yeah, it's all right. It hasn't quite grasped me uh, immediately as, as something I'd want to play. But I was on end, I don't think. I don't know. It's got that kind of... There's a certain feeling to it where I thought it was okay, like uh, Lies of P. I never finished Lies of P. I got a bit bored and I'm wondering if this is going to be a similar thing. Uh, yeah, I, I'm, un, I'm undecided. Uh, and I think I've played it for long enough now, just, you know, with regards to recording. So I'm going to leave it here. I don't know. I may continue to play it for maybe another hour or so and then just think, do you know what? I'm kind of done. Or I give it another hour. I might think this is actually something I really need right now. I don't know. But as it stands in the sort of skip to the end section, it, it's okay so far. It's, it's kind of enjoyable. What was that noise? What's he doing? Right, okay. Yeah, I mean, it's tempting to hit him on the head with an axe, but uh, let's see what happens. No, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Right, okay, that's it. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what to say. Yeah. Whatever. Video's going to end now. Meh.